Hello everyone, today I'll be showing you the location of every blessing shrine. There's five in total, and if you press the T button, or go to the tribes tab, on the side here you see this tree, and this is where you can see which ones you have unlocked already. They give a ton of bonuses, like bamboo, more yellow grass, more bones, as well as 50% herbs. This is something I wish I had from the very beginning, so do make sure to get them when you just start playing. The nice thing about it is they can all be found in the grassland, meaning the first area of the game, so you don't have to unlock anything. For each location, I'll show the map for a few seconds, and then show the surroundings, so you can pause whenever we get to a new area. Do keep in mind that these boosts only count for your tribe, not for yourself. Alright, the first one is pretty easy. It is right here, right on your way towards the altar. You have a bit of an intersection here. And if you walk back a little bit, if you go near this tree, there's a crossroad here. And if you go that way, that is where the village is. This is one you most likely find on your own because it is on the path towards the altar, like I said before. And this is the boost that gives you 25% extra bamboo resources. Now this next area is kind of hidden away, but it is slightly northwest of the grasslands. Now this might be the most difficult one to find yet. What I recommend is if you follow the river and go towards the bend here, you have this little stone path. Follow it over here. Keep following this gray road looking area that has a bunch of puddles in it. Follow it under the rock. And right there is the shrine. If you go towards the entrance that leads over to Sandland, there's a giant patch with yellow grass right next to the river, so you could follow the river along as well. And in the middle here, you find a little shrine. This gives you 25% more yellow grass. Alright, the best way to find the next one is actually right at the start of your journey. When you follow the path and eventually jump down, I find the cave that leads to the village. Before you enter the cave, just jump down. And there's a path. Follow the path up the hill. And there is another shrine. Right there. This gives you 25% extra herbs. And the last one is kind of both in the open, but also hidden very well. It is very close to the last one, actually. You just jump down the hill. And this will give you a 25% boost in the Hunter's Hut. So I hope this quick guide helped you out. Again, these are some very powerful buffs to get early on in the game. I wish I had them when I started out. If you want to see my playthrough of this game, I'll leave a link down in the description. I hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye everyone.